called emergent theories. And emergent theories are a little more complex, such as the one that I'm going to quote from here, a theory of constructed emotion, would actually look at all these other theories and, and schools of thought and say that there's, there's an element of truth in each one of them, but you're, it's like you're looking at a diamond, but you're seeing all these different facets of this diamond. Lisa Feldman Barrett is a, a researcher and a neuroscientist who studies emotion. And she developed the theory of constructed emotion. And here's what she says. In every waking moment, let's stop right there. This is how I used to do when I was a preacher. I'd say, okay, we're going to cover 40 verses. And then I'd read one phrase and I'd say, oh, let's just stop right there. Um, in every waking moment, that's important. In other words, constantly throughout your day, right here, right now, in this moment, uh, earlier today on your lunch break, after that in the meeting with your boss via Zoom, the 12th Zoom meeting you've had this week, uh, first thing this morning when your kids were hollering from the other room when you hadn't had a cup of coffee yet. Every waking moment, she says, your brain uses past experience organized as concepts. Okay, so you've got these past experiences and your brain is going to take all your past experience and organize it into concepts. So in every waking moment, your brain uses past experience organized as concepts to guide your actions and give your sensations. Here she's talking about your body sensations, meaning. And when the concepts involved are emotion concepts, your brain constructs instances of emotion. 